Infratech Sophia uses different sample cells depending on the size of the particular grain being analysed. The sample cells can be changed while the instrument is powered on or powered off. To change the sample cell while the instrument is powered off, pull out the sample drawer and lift the instrument hood exposing the sample handling wheel. To access the commodity sample, the front cover of the sample wheel should be removed. The cover is attached to the tightened nut, so is removed when the nut is loosened for the cover to be lifted away. As the instrument is not connected to a power supply, the sample handling wheel can be turned manually to bring the four cylinders to the top to make them accessible. Warning: The sample wheel should only be rotated manually if the unit is powered off, otherwise gearbox damage will result. Lift out the sample cell from its position in the sample handling wheel. Take the new sample cell, in this example the sample cell for analysing canola, and insert it into the same position as the previous sample cell. All sample cells have the same notch in the rim of the cylinder, which guides correct positioning of the cell in the sample handling wheel. Make sure the cell clicks into place with the matching pin. Place the sample cell you have removed into the accessory kit for safekeeping. There are two square holes cut into the foam padding for the storage of additional sample cells. You may now turn the sample handling wheel by hand to the home position and refit the faceplate. Check the notches line up as you refit it. It should click into place, then hand tighten the nut until it is finger tight. Connect the unit to the power. Close the hood and drawer. Remember before using the Sophia unit to test canola sample, the software will need to be set up using the following steps. On the instrument display, the startup screen can be seen. The progress bar at the bottom of the screen progresses from left to right. The startup procedure takes approximately 7 to 10 minutes. The unit is doing the self-checking and heating the lamp up to the working temperature. When the instrument has completed its startup test, the words check cell mean that the instrument is now in check cell mode. Press the orange soft key to start the check cell analysis. This operation takes about three minutes and the time remaining is indicated by the progress bar moving from left to right. This screen shows a successfully completed check cell analysis. The result pass is now highlighted. Now press the soft key grain shown here. Use the up down arrow keys to scroll down to the commodity type that you want to test. Once the canola commodity is highlighted, press the soft key select to pick this commodity. Now the Infratech Sophia is ready to analyse canola samples.